Uh, okay, Assalamualaikum. Alright, and a good day. So my name is Muhammad Nazim bin Hamzah. I'm a lecturer at uh, UKI Matex for quality engineering section. So I will be the instructor for non-destructive testing method. So in this video, I will be demonstrating to you on how to conduct visual inspection testing method. So for visual testing method, we will not using any equipment. So we'll be using our eyes only. So the sample that we'll be using here is the sample box. Okay. It will state the visual. Okay. So this is the sample that we'll be using to conduct the visual inspection. So uh, the equipment that will assist in this method, such as this magnifying glass. So this magnifying glass will help us to enlarge any small uh, defect or discrepancy that can be seen on the surface of the defects. And we'll be using a wire brush and a oil or uh, anti-rust cleaner. So this is to uh, clean the surface or to remove any rust or impurities that we that can uh, have on the surface of the sample and the white tissue that will be used to clean the surface okay so the first step to conduct this method is to take your desired sample just take any sample okay so for example just take any sample okay so for each sample it will have its own a special numbers, special sample numbers. For example, here is stated is six A. So this is sample six A. So for each sample, it has its own uh, specific types of defects. Okay. So each defect has been uh, labeled and written in the <coughs> manual, in the standard manual. <coughs> So the first procedure to conducting visual inspection is to ensure that the, your surrounding or your lighting is sufficient for you to conduct the inspection method. So you need to ensure that at least uh, 80 flux and above before we can uh, conduct this test method. So if the lighting is not sufficient, you can use the system of a torch light and to assist in uh, ensuring that you can see or you can clearly visualize what uh, of the surface defects. So the next procedure, okay, so is to clean, to, to pre, pre clean the sample. So use oil or anti rust, okay, and put it on the sample. So again, we'll be conducting uh, inspection on the weldment area, okay. So take your wire brush and rub your sample to remove an impurities or rust. And then use the tissue to wipe the excess oil or excess anti rust. Okay. So you can see the impurities or the rust that have on the surface of the environment. So now we can use the magnifying glass and to inspect eh, the sample that can be visually appear on the surface. So next is to take out your pencil and mark the starting point and the end point of the defects. Okay, and measure the length of the defect and put it into your report. So once you have taken your measurement, uh, identify the types of defects. So for example, for 6A, the type of defect is porosity. So as you can see, the type of defect is porosity. So once you have taken the pictures, and state it into your uh, report. Okay. Lastly, apply a little bit of oil. This is to preserve uh, the surface from uh, corrosion. So now you can store back the samples into its designated box. Okay. And clean out the waste that, that you has been used. And clean out your workstation. So
so that is it very simple to conduct visual testing or visual inspection okay so thank you for watching so good luck on your practical session assalamualaikum